Inflation is still stubbornly high, which means rising costs could be here a little longer. Thanks for joining us. I'm Quinicia Fraser. I'm Bill Shimmer. The latest report shows prices rose 0.4% from March to April. Year over year, costs are up nearly 5%. And while people in our community turn to organizations for help, the nonprofits say they still haven't recovered from the pandemic. KETV Newswatch 7's Jessica Perez is live with their effort to stretch resources as far as possible. Jessica? Food pantries and places offering financial assistance say they've seen resources available during the pandemic disappear. But with inflation still high, the need for services won't decrease anytime soon. Inflation's impacted the price of many basic necessities, including food and rent. This not only hurts the people in poverty, but those wanting to help them. Whether you're somebody walking through the door asking for help, whether you're the organization like Together that's trying to procure the food, or you're the food bank that's our, our major food sourcing um, partner, all of us are really adjusting to this new landscape. And with the pandemic aid gone, nonprofits have fewer resources to help. Mike Hornacek, the CEO of Together, says his pantry struggled to keep shelves full. Rent, utility assistance, um, hygiene kits, diapers, you know, you, you could kind of go down the list of what the resource is. Um, it's a very similar kind of story. During the pandemic, Together had millions in federal funds to distribute for rent and utilities. Now they only have $75,000 in their budget to help. Instead of previously us paying the entire bill, it could be we're going to pay half and ask you to try and find the other half. Hornacek says nonprofits have looked for creative ways to meet the need, like growing their own food and lobbying Congress. It's very challenging. But immediate solutions are hard to come by. Most of the answers are longer term solutions. There's not a lot that we can do in the next 12 to 18 months. Hornacek says Together is working to advocate for elevated SNAP benefits as another way to help people experiencing food insecurity. If you are in need of resources, you can find food pantry and financial assistance op options under this story at ktv.com. Just know if you do qualify for help, it may be less than what you need. Back to you guys.